What's up, people? So we're back today with some more Tekken 8 footage. It's a gameplay reveal trailer for Leo. All right, let's go ahead and get right into it. Let's see what she can do. looks really strong yeah I saw a couple things there that was like huh wow all right let's go ahead and take a look at this in slow-mo you know we usually do uh all right so let's see here all right so first of all the drip is um is is dope I like the outfit here it's like a Super upgraded version of her defaults from previous games. It looks really good. The red, the black, you know, the blue pants, the boots, all that stuff looks really good. So let's see. Um, yeah, and the face. Her face looks really good. Yeah, I like it. Most of the characters' faces look like super, super upgraded in this game. Called Jen stepping with uh, looks like a forward two into a roundhouse. So this here, from the stance, a heat engager that hits grounded and guarantees a stomp. So that's like a that's like a people's elbow type move, like what King has. That's a uh, really good for Leo to have another one. That string there reminds me of Katarina. Like her, um, what was that, down forward, two forward? It looks almost identical, I want to say. Except it starts with a high. Well, that roundhouse is clean. Okay, so that's close circle forward, two, one. Knocks down. Oh, that's a, oh, I didn't see that. So it's a power crush, heat engager, hits grounded. So we know it's a mid. Wow. That's a very good move. Okay. So Jen does hop kick. She blocks it, punishes one four. Oh, he goes into the stance. Wow. Wow. Yo. Leo's punishment is ridiculously good. A new low from the stance. Goes into Kraus dash. While standing one, two, into a charge. Oh, wow. They just showed two new Punishers in one interaction. That is crazy. That is good. That is really good. Yo, is, is she the best Punisher already? 
This is this is looking like some really good stuff. One four into the um, I don't know the name of the stance, but the the stance there. So she kept the buff down for two launches, crouchers, new tail spin. I'm sure that's probably um, up forward one two reanimated instead of a straight punch. Um, she does an uppercut for the tail tail spin. Yeah. Looks like you might be able to cancel that, but I don't know. So that's back four into one plus two, cancels it. Wow. That's definitely a new move. Nice wall combo carry. Well, no, no, it slides him, it slides him. What is that move there? Crouch dash two, four, maybe? Slides him really far though. Okay, so that there is a nerf, so that doesn't, uh, or did this wall splat? I can't remember. Let me know in the comments. Did Wild Rising 1 plus 2 um, wall splat in previous games? I'm sure it did, but now it counsels to, wow, the key charge move, but it's not a key charge. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's so fast, the, um, like the hit sparks, I can't tell if that's a key charge or like a new personality trait buff or whatever. I don't know. Okay, so yeah, that move there used to be your wall combo ender. Oh wow, so what is that? That heat engager? So where did this come from here? Yeah, I don't know the command for that. That's just a, a total new move. He ends with a heat engager. Now this here is dope though. She actually knows Azucena. That is that is really good. That's a that's really great job. Like great job to Bamco. Bringing in new characters and they know other characters. <laughs> Not necessarily saying they know, but they have a intro. They have an intro. Yeah, Leo's actually like, what? Coffee Queen? How's it seen him with the kick? It gets swatted away. I like that. Get that stuff out of here. Okay, Hail Sweep on counter hit still launches. Wow, so what? Yeah, this is just a new move, a uh, uppercut, the backhand. Okay, heat burst. Dope animation for the heat burst. Okay, and that's the um, back forward one plus two string with the blue sparkle at the end, that's dope. Okay, so that's quarter circle four, one. By standing four, one plus two still guaranteed. But this is huge though here, guys. This is a heat engager for a 11 frame Punisher. Okay, yeah, this is this is pretty big. Yeah, so if you get one of your lows blocked against Leo, this, this is huge. This means that you give her whatever recoverable health that she's losing, as long as it's, uh, I don't know the exact percentage, but it's a huge amount. Heat engages give a lot of that recoverable health back. Not all of it, but a lot of it. Yeah, you're gonna get put into this uh, mix up here. So, okay, so that's a heat smash. It's a mid attack, thank goodness. Okay, so that's the, I think back one plus four, still guaranteeing the, wow, back two, one plus two, also a heat engager. Yeah, that is crazy. Her punishment is ridiculous. Oh wow. That looks like another heat smash there. So yeah, this here. The new low that she did earlier in the trailer gets buffed while in heat, or that's just a straight up heat smash from that stance. That is crazy. 
Okay, so that's the uh, the new move she entered a combo with earlier. Heat Engager gets a combo from Heat Dash. And this is just a new string here. That's that's cool. That string that led into that. I think it's Bach 1 2. Okay, and that's a new new animation there for um, Hail Sweep from Key Charge. And it looks like she accesses it from that new power up. So that's actually really good if she doesn't have to actually do like a true key charge to access those moves. Okay, so down two, boom. Big counter hit launcher. I wonder if it's still plus on block. That's, that's a serious buff though, because I don't think down two on counter hit gave a, a bounce like that in Tekken 7. Yeah, this is new. So she has the uh, <laughs> the grappling hook flying around like Batman. Okay, here's the kick. Ooh. And then a huge Iron Mountain shoulder. You're finished. <laughs> oh, all right. Yeah. Azucena is in pain. Yeah, that, that's a devastating shoulder. Yeah, I thought she was about to bust out the Armor King outro there. Well, the King outro with the flip. But that's a that's a new spin. Got you. Yeah, that's a dope. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to use that picture there for the YouTube thumbnail. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, that's... um quite crazy so my biggest takeaway from all of this is that whenever Leo has heat mode activated her punishment is just ridiculous well forget heat mode being activated like if she's just in need of a 50 50 all she has to do is block so if she blocks something that's punishable, then you're gonna be you're gonna be hurting because um it was I think it was um over here somewhere. Yeah, yeah, she blocks a low or she blocks a hop kick. I don't know where it was. Let me start it over. I'm gonna play it in uh, regular speed. Yeah. Yeah, that there, like that. One four to the stance, yeah, man. <laughs> and then she gets all these different mix-ups. Yeah, look at that. Excellent, excellent punishment. Yeah, her punishment actually like leading to huge mix-ups that you can't do anything about. That is huge. That is really huge. And then a lot of punishers actually going into a heat engager. That is, that is insane. Well, I won't say a lot. I won't say a lot. It was actually one that we saw. Um, well, two. We saw two. Yeah, while standing four, like here, heat engage. That's huge. That means that's gonna launch if she has heat mode activated. And this here, I think back to one plus two was a um, a fourteen frame punisher. So. Yeah, she blocks like a king gut punch or a um, a jack down forward two or something like that. Then she gets a, a big payoff here. Yeah, because that, that also will be a launcher if heat mode is already activated. So, um, yeah, this is like a, a, a punish, a, a punisher, like, extraordinaire. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't know what else to say. Like, this is ultimate punishment. Let me know what you guys think about Leo here, because, um, yeah, I, I see, like, the ultimate punishing character next to, like, Lars, Mishima's, you know, those type. But she's actually getting heat engagers, so this is huge. On top of having, you know, no difficulty as far as execution. Yeah, she's going to be very strong. I already see that. Yeah, defense is definitely going to win with Leo. Yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, 
hit the like button subscribe if you haven't already definitely going to be covering all the rest of the trailers for Tekken 8 the the last few characters that are left well it's more than a few it's actually like what 10 at this point in the coming weeks leading to the release of the game so uh be on the lookout for that guys and you guys have a great one i'll see you at the next video peace